Ever since we humans first gazed at the red planet, we've wondered what Mars was like. And now we know. These images were captured by Spirit and Opportunity, two robots that have roamed the surface for the last 10 years. The images tell a story of Mars that was very different in the past. It was, it's cold, it's dry today, but in the past, as these images show us, Mars was different. It was warmer, it was wetter, it was more like Earth. These images also tell a story of exploration. Uh, not just the science, but the, but the process of uncovering that science and driving for kilometers across the surface of another world and exploring as you go. The Mars Exploration Rover mission was launched by NASA in 2003 to find evidence of water, and it did. These pictures at the National Air and Space Museum reveal rock formations, mineral deposits, surface ripples and indentations that could only have been made by water. The image behind me is a stack of layered rocks, and those rocks are made of 40% sulfate salt. This is the kind of stuff that forms when you have like salty seawater that evaporates away and it leaves salts behind. We can measure the composition, we can read the story that the rocks tell, it's like a history book. The mission was expected to last just three months, but Spirit kept going for more than six years, and Opportunity is still gathering information. Apart from being stunning works of art, these images captured by the two rovers tell the story of evolution on Mars. They show rock formations that give evidence of water and may one day even answer that eternal question, was there once life on Mars? John Grant helps direct the rover mission and says scientists are tantalizingly close to finding out. The next rover, the 2020 rover, is going to kind of make the next step towards life. It's not a life detection mission but it's moving in that direction. And as we see a planet that once must have been much more Earth-like than it is today, this idea that Mars once could have harbored life becomes something that's very realistic to me, and I, I want to see how that plays out. To be certain, rocks will have to be brought back to Earth, and plans are also underway for the first human exploration of Mars. Thanks to these images, the astronauts will at least know what to expect. Jane O'Brien, BBC News, Washington.